A lot of guys uh, I don't know because I was not here, you know, the whole summer. So just uh, uh, getting to adjust to them and, um, and to play with them. And everybody's looking good. Uh, everybody that I know, you know, looking good. Yeah, everybody seems to be pretty excited about being back. Uh, definitely. You can, you can see that. You can feel, you know, the excitement. Everybody's happy to be back and, and ready to go. And you can see it with Pop, too. Pop, he, he looks like very motivated. And, and uh, we have a high expectation. So everybody's ready to work hard. You know, Antonio said yesterday that he was surprised by some of the talent that's here. Do you see some yeah, pretty good talent? Yeah, definitely. We have a lot of talent. And uh, all the young guys, you know, they're playing well. Uh, they improved from last year. So I uh, definitely can't wait, you know, when we start the games and see uh, how everything's going to work out. How's it been having Jacques back around coaching you? Oh, it's great. It's great. I love Jacques. You know, I played with him, and uh, he's a great mind. You know, he loves basketball, and uh, you can see already, you know, he, He's going to be a great coach, and I will not be surprised in three, four years he's a head coach. You know, he's, he's that smart, and um, he's very passionate about it. Does it mean you've been in the league a while when guys you played with are now coaching? <laughs> I know everybody I played with, you know, Danny Ferry, Steve Kerr. Yeah. <laughs> uh, they, they all like him, all coaches, Terry Porter. So you know, now it's just another one. <laughs> Tony, everybody comes into camp trying to have improved something in their mm -hmm. game mm -hmm. this summer. Um, what did you work on this summer? What are, you, are you noticing dividends already? I was very early, but um, for me it was just work on my body. And um, you know, my whole motivation this year is to play. You know, I want to play 82 games and I want to be healthy. And um, and um, that's my main focus. And basketball-wise, I still work on the same thing. You know, work on my shot and free throws and stuff like that. Uh, you know, the, it's the process. You know, what we're doing with Chip, and um, it's going well. Did you feel um, last year because of injuries? Your first step, your quickness was down a little bit, and is that back? Oh, definitely, definitely. Um, you know, that plantar fasciitis, you know, it was tough to, to handle. And this year, I definitely feel like I'm quicker and, and back to normal. Did Brunke have a bad summer or something? He's torturing you guys over there. I don't know. He loves it. He <laughs> loves it. But uh, I'm used to it. I, I did that for two months in L.A., so, uh, you know, I don't mind anymore. I guess it's a good way to get you guys in um, tip-top shape. Oh, definitely, definitely. But I heard that everybody was doing the same thing here in San Antonio. And, yeah, everybody worked hard uh, with Brungi and everybody, everybody's focused. In, in NFL training camps, there's hazing and guys have to do certain <laughs> things like carry shoulder pads and get haircuts. Manu's not a rookie. What happened to his hair? <laughs> oh, no comment. <laughs> <laughs> I did ask him who cut him. You know, it was weird. I asked him, you know, what what he wanted out of that haircut, <laughs> and um, and Manu said that. I just told him to do whatever whatever he wants. So I was like, it looks good he, on you, though. Right? I told him if you need a number, you know, I know somebody who <laughs> can do a better job. You know, but well, you know, he doesn't care. Mike was wondering if maybe his twins gave him the haircut. Who? Monroe was wondering if uh, the, the twins. twins. <laughs> Looks like it. <laughs> hey, Tony, I want to get your initial impression of Thiago, seeing him out here with you guys. And well, I've been knowing Thiago for a long time. I'm playing against him overseas, and um, I know what he can do. And so uh, now it's just a, a matter of to see what he can do in the NBA. But uh, he definitely can play. Uh, he's a smart player, got a lot of experience, and he's in the same situation when the Manu first came. You know, he played a lot of big games and won championships. So hopefully, you know, he can adapt quick and, and help us out. How much better is he than when, when you played with him over there? Uh, more mature, more experienced, uh, stronger. And, uh, you know, he's, he's smarter too. When I played against him, he was a little bit younger. He was 21, 20. So now he's like 25, and you can see that he's more mature. Given the way you guys are built, do, do you think his skills are going to fit in nicely? Yeah, I think so. I think he's definitely going to fit our team and um, definitely going to fit with Timmy.